I have a announcement slash update on Nordomatic Explorer. I got a message last night and a missed phone call, but I was busy playing uh, with games and I didn't actually get the messages because my notifications were off. So I replied today and what is happening is that Robert Burke, you've probably heard that name because he's been running the Chicago Pinball Expo for, hmm, I just got a message today in my email that said the anniversary or the total number of years, but it's a lot, 20 or 40 or maybe not 40, I think it was 22 years, I don't know, but I just got an email today also saying Chicago Pinball Expo, October 2021, it is happening. And also, from what I understand, the border is opening up from Canada to the U.S. Uh, next month. So, I ended up calling Robert Burke back and we talked about Nordomatic Explorer because he wanted it. He is building a museum, he said. Now, I don't know if this is uh, breaking news or what, but I don't imagine spreading the word is going to do any harm. And he wants this machine for the collection. So, it is a done deal. Robert Burke is now the new owner of Nordomatic Explorer. I'm so happy it's going to a museum where it can be appreciated by many. Instead of just, you know, some random person who wants a pinball machine for their basement that doesn't really truly appreciate the machine for what it is. So, Robert Burke is the perfect candidate for this machine and I'm so happy that it is going to end up in his museum. So, Nordomatic is going bye-bye. We don't have the logistics quite figured out, but I think uh, Rob Noel, shout out, is going to be part of the equation. He'll help me uh, pack and pallet this guy up. But that is the Nordomatic Explorer update. Um, Actually, uh, it was kind of fun negotiating with Robert. Uh, he's like mentioned something about a windfall of money, and I was like thinking in my head, "Oh, he just came upon a bunch of money, and uh, you know wants to to buy the machine using that money." I mean, we agreed at a price. I'll just say between a thousand and two thousand dollars Canadian. So it's not like we're talking ten thousand dollars here, uh, but. What, I guess what he was actually referring to when he said windfall of money was that if he bought the machine off me, this was part of his negotiation, then I would have a windfall of money. And he mentioned I could share $10 with Johnny for a toy and, you know, $15 to Susie for, you know, a, a pony or I don't know. It, it was fun to negotiate with him. Um, yeah, so uh, we worked out a deal. He's already paid. And it's just a matter of working out the logistics. So that is the fate of Nordomatic Explorer. It is a good fate indeed. Well, Rob Noel called me today and said he got a message from a shipping company that says they're going to show up on Friday. And it is Tuesday. So that means it's time to pack up explorer but as you can see uh got a couple things in the way the cart the tool cart the stool the table full of parts trash bin some calmer stuff underneath the machine it's basically surrounded <laughs> uh, so i have to start packing this guy up and, and see if i can get jay the neighbor to help me load it into my vehicle tonight and then I'll drive it over to Rob's tomorrow and probably set it up there so he can bang away on it for a little bit and get the Explorer experience before it goes south of the border to Rob Burke. So from one Rob to another, from a Mike to a Rob then to a Rob. So time to pack her up. So maybe I'll record some of these shenanigans and uh, time lapse for fun.
as I was dissembling, disassembling, it dawned on me that this means I can bring in a new toy. Now this space here, because of the structure, it means that I can only fit a short machine in here, no DMD, solid state only. So that narrows my options down. But I've got some options. I'm not sure what it is yet that I'll want to move into that space. But anyway, Explorer is ready to go. It's been fun, Explorer. And you're going to a happy place. I don't know if I'll document any of the delivering to Rob Noel and I don't know, saying hi to him, but eh, that might be the end of this video. May not be, you never know. But yep, pretty sweet.